Mm, Soul Roll was one of those maps um, that was added to, well, the Sota Cup map pool to get a little bit of variation in there. Mm. We also had Ancient Isles there. And um, that was another map, not sure. But yeah, Snowdrop was a pretty cool map, I have to say. Uh, two player map, even though it's a very, very big map. Uh, big map. Yeah, big map as well. No, it's a big map. <laughs> and um, yeah, I think I should give you a little tour here because I don't really see this map anymore. Mm, we have a mercenary camp here in the middle. Oh, really heavily guarded and uh, also with some gates and rocks here so to get in here you need to kill the gate or um, yeah the boulders here um, besides that close mine pretty uh, gold mine pretty close to the starting position here it's also rather easy to creep uh, we have some big gold mine creeps here in each corner and uh, yeah, besides that, we have taverns, we have goblin merchants, we have goblin laboratories. So yeah, pretty much all you can ask for on this map. And um, yeah, rewind starting top right here on Snowdrop. Demon Hunter as the first hero. I see two moon wells and the first Ancient of War creep here at the Skeletal Archer creep camp. The Orc player, bottom left, going for the Blade Masters, the first hero. Grants are in production, second Orc Borough as well, Blade but so far we attack. are not seeing a Voodoo launch, so yeah, he's probably going for some harassment here. We'd walk the first kill for the Orc player. Out of player, now last hitting the creeps here. Gets the first tomb, gets the tomb of strength. And yeah, kills the last creep now as well. And he's chasing the peon now. Oh, Blade Master, sold to TP, get himself a circlet. Peon sacrifices himself to the creeps. Oh, Demon Hunter, getting more and more hits here, not a backstab. Uh, back in his main base, he's using those moon wells to heal himself up. Engine of Four made his way back to the main base. And Remind is taking turn tier two. Uh, player is going for some moon well harassment here. Was able to cancel the first one. Repair on the next moon well here. Let's take a quick look at the main base of who. He's taking to tier two. He's getting the voodoo launch now. And yeah, some more grunts. So far, so good. And who now? Going back. It's not too successful as harassment here. We mind killing a deer. And both players, yeah, at the shop almost 19 o'clock, so both <coughs> trying to get the boots of speed here, but the demon hunter getting attacked by the creeps. So yeah. Who gets the boots of speed here and has the speed advantage, at least for a short amount of time. And is now going for the first pre camp of his own. He's going for those Ice Throw Berserkers. Bottom right. Gets the first item, gets the gloves of haste. Circlets, yeah, are from the shop. Ice Throw High Priest. Or the next unit to go down, but the Demon Hunter is going in. Uh, not able to get a creep still here. Uh, at least burning some mana points off the Blade Master. Let's see, Remind. Yeah, so far we don't see a Hunter's Hall or anything. So we'll be Druids of the Talon. Like on map number one. Let's see what he is doing against it this time. First, he's getting out of Orkboro. Now the Demon Hunter with the Boots of Speed as well. Does of appearance also in the inventory. And there we go. Tier 2 tech has finished. Tier 3 tech gets started immediately. And we have the Beastmaster as the second hero. And some cool frozen Quilbys here. <coughs> 
<clears throat> and Remind. Ah, going in for a small creep check here. Cats from Malabanov, but takes a lot of damage here on his first hero already. He's trying to uh, kill the Blade Master, but now the Beast Master is in a bad position here. Next Quill Beast gets summoned. Blade Master is close to the shop. Oh, the Demon Hunter. Demon Hunter gets killed. What about the Blade Master? He is at tier 2, but he's only getting a healing self here. And he is able to get away. So, yeah, that's one of those signature moves here for who he knows when to run and he knows, um, yeah, when to buy healing potions and stuff like that. And yeah, not panicking, not using 150 gold for healing potion. Nope. The 100 gold were enough to save the Blade Master and getting a hero kill. So, yeah, nicely done once again by the Orc player. Who? Creeping. Next skeletal creep camp here on the left hand side. Demon Hunter is out of the altar. Was well, only level 1 Demon Hunter, so this is rather quick. Two Angels of Wind. Adapt training. And talents in production. And we have the TC as the second hero. And once again, Spirit Lodge and Beastry with the Spirit Walkers and the Raiders. And yeah, probably also, if you're just familiar with the current state of Warcraft 3, yeah, back in those days, you were able to get your Spirit Walkers from the Spirit Lodge. Nowadays, you obviously need to build a Torrent Totem for them. Back then, Spirit Lodge was the way to go. Oh, now the player now creeping the shop here on the right hand side with the Angel of War support. Orgami moves in. Uh, there's not too much he can do at the moment, especially without the ensnare upgrade, which is still getting researched here. There we go. Riemann is a tier 3. He's getting a druid of the title master upgrade. And um yeah. Has the Orb of Venom now as well. Angel of War is getting attacked. Knight of Army moves in. Mana burn on the Blade Master. So no more Wind Walks for this dude. Angel of War gets killed. Wisp Detonate here. Hmm. A player's forces are under attack. Who now with the scroll of healing here? Trying to kill the giant polar bear. Let's see if he's able to. Yes, he is. Oh, gets a land on a storm wind. Which is a good item. Especially when you have fear of fire. On your units. Because, yeah, devotion aura gives you increased armor. Oh, the spirit walker. Okay, no mana burn here by the demon hunter. Let's see. Yeah, Remont just constantly building more units. He's a 32 supply at the moment. And who 48. But yeah, his TC is still level 1. Blade Master is level 3 at least, but he needs the level 3 shockwave. Okay. Sells the sells the aura. And yeah, he's now going for the next goblin merchant creep here. We have the third here now. Yeah, there we have Mecha Gop for Remind. Tinker joining the party now as well. Beastmaster gets a big evil potion here. Gold mine. Oh, and I'm map pinging, so it must be something very important. Oh, Vampiric Aura. Oh boy. That's not too shabby. Imbu potion here. A town is under oh, the Blade Master. Which gets detonated. Gets another, gets the first scroll of healing, in fact. 
42 supply against 57. So I'll play with a big, big supply advantage now. And he's also pulling out the peons. But the Terran Chief Tain still level 1, so he's uh, so still no shockwave here. XX Foggy, do you remember Tillerman? Uh, of course I do, and I already casted some games of him. Not sure if they're uploaded um, to my YouTube already, but um, yeah, did some Tillerman games um, for WC, uh, WCG 2.3, I think. But let's focus on the fight here first. A lot of Cyclone going on here. GC with the level 2 scroll speed, trying to get into a good position. Where's the Shockwave? Where's the Shockwave? There's the first Shockwave, obviously not doing too much damage here. And we still have a scroll of feeling here on the Beastmaster. Org army constantly up in the air. Blade Master now with the Evil Potion. Going for the Tinker. GC gets another Mana Burn. So no Mana for another Shockwave. Dribbling gets casted once again. And Remind with a nice micro here. Invo Potion used on the Beastmaster. Well, yeah, Beastmaster was surrounded. What about the scroll feelings? Okay, Orc player also has a scroll feeling. Uses the scroll now. And this is, yeah, TP forced on Remind. And the Night Elf is back into his own main base. Tinker was just running away. <laughs> Electic six. I see remind join the stream. Yeah. Also one of those legends. And Walker Free. Kinda wondering what he's up to at the moment. Because I'm not aware um that he's still playing. But yeah, please uh, feel free to correct me if I'm wrong. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Blade Master running to the Night of Army with Fury Fire on him. So, yeah. He's visible, that's for sure. Trying to creep check the Remind here. Spider is now also joining the fun Shockwave. By the Torn Chief Tain, still level 1 Shockwave, not doing too much. Beastmaster almost surrounded, gets focused and yeah, drops a lot of HP here. But the Spiders now attacking the Orc army as well and the Focus Fire kicks in. Uh, Raiders are dropping, Scroll Feelings were used. Oh, Blade Master gets Cyclone once again. And there is another Dispel, Mana Burn, what about the Tinker? Tinker gets focused and killed and there's another TP here by Remind. <laughs> and there we go, level up, finally level 3 for the Torrent Chieftain and Hinchy with the follow and the Prime Sub right after that. Thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. Welcome to the stream. And uh, yeah, thanks for your support already. Man, that's crazy. And, um, yeah, my favorite player ever, Electric 6. Yeah, Remind was great. Um, I also, I think I met him two times? I think it was two times at the games from when there were the big W, uh, the, the NGL finals and stuff like that. And, um, yeah. It was a super cool dude. Uh, was kind of hard to communicate with the Koreans back then because, um, yeah, their English was not the best back then. They have improved a lot over the years. So, yeah, that's also uh, kind of cool. Um, but, yeah. Was always a nice fella, that's for sure. Players' forces are under attack. Okay, let's check Remind's army real quick. 46 supply. What's happening? New York members, not too much. 57 here for the Orc player. So, yeah. He has the supply advantage. He has two scrolls of healing and a Nimble Potion. So, it's not looking too shabby. And he also forced two TPs out of the Night Elf. Just selling an item gets a, a scroll of healing. How many scrolls attack. does he have? Only one scroll, but two healing potions, uh, which are equally important against the hero focusing orc player. 
mind. So now creeping. Goblin Laboratory here. Blue Drake gets killed. Ring of Regeneration. Level 2 for Tinker. And we see the first Fairy Dragon now. Our player also finishing Goblin Laboratory here. Gets a Talisman of Evasion. Which goes to the TC here. Yeah. No Wormel for who? So no upgrades. And the main gold mines, yeah, 3,000 gold still remaining. So still some mining time left, but yeah. Both players should probably think about an expansion rather soon. Well, let's see if this is happening. Two fairy drinks now. Level 3 Beast Master. Yeah, with the Kobe's level 2 and the Hawk level 1. Demon Hunter level 3, Tinker level 2. And a lot of illusions scouting now. And there's the real Blade Master as well. And obviously the Vampiric are super nice here for the Org Army. And there we go, MTW who builds a great haul. So he's going for the expansion. Can't say the same about Riemann at the moment. He's focused on creeping. Okay, he made his way <laughs> into the mercenary camp creep attack. position thingy here. Now the Blade Master is close by. Gets scouted with the Hawk. So Riemann is not going all in this creep camp because yeah, it would have been a horrible position for, for him. <clears throat> Let's see. Is he breaking upkeep? Yes, he is. 58 supply for Remind. And who now attacking the main base of the Knight of Player? Yeah, but just a few hits. Oh, okay. Greedy Raider here. With an ensnare on a dude of the Talon, but gets cycloned. And killed. That's for sure. Man, the cyclone lasts forever. There we go. There he gets killed. At least one more snare. And yeah. Cool. In the meantime, going for the mercenary camp here. Level 4 TC. And now Remind is going in for the creep check. Bad Rider killed one of the fairy rings, but the second is still alive. So both first heroes with the Immo Potion right away. TC is up in the air. What are those spirit walkers doing? Nothing at the moment. Trying to kill some talents here. First shockwave was used by the TC. Gets mana, but still has a mana stone in his inventory. Two raiders now trying to kill those rules of the talent, but the Orc army is oh, oh, horribly split. Small feeling now used by Remind. There's another Dispel. Demon Hunter now getting focused. Next and Snare. Next Cyclone. Next Dispel. Focus fire. There was a critical strike. Demon Hunter should probably get away. What about the Beastmaster? Get stabbed now. Demon Hunter is also getting away. And the Org Army is just melting. He was focusing the heroes, but he lost all of his units in the process. Remind now with a Frost Revenant as well. There's the Blizzard now. <laughs> attacking the Orc units here with the Blizzard. There's a Dispel. The Revenant gets focused right away and killed. But, yeah. More and more Raiders are going down as well. Demon Hunter gets the healing potion from the Tinker. Gets a level up. TC gets killed. Blade Master with the GG. 